hydroponics, a new way of food production using limited space and water, is gaining traction. The technology is being tried out at a grassroots level to boost the growing of vegetables at your home. The Nelson Mandela Metropolitan University and a private company is behind the aquaponics research. The food produced in the project will go to underprivileged primary schools in the Missionvale area in the Eastern Cape. This project combines aquaculture with aquaponics. Fish production on the one side, complementing the plant production. A closed loop, as the fish water feeds the plants. The tilapia fish provide protein while vegetables like lettuce, spinach, peppers and herbs are growing on minimal water. The system itself, it is very simple and it is also very adaptable and very climate smart. Uh, so even people in the rural areas or even just ordinary households, they can be able to build a similar unit. The process also cuts out chemicals and fertilizers. Even though you use the gravel, it's all natural because you don't use any chemical, you don't use any fertilizer, commercial fertilizer. Your fish work as a source of your nutrients because every waste that they produce is being pumped into the vegetable part. In and around Nelson Mandela Bay, a number of schools grow their own crops. Some are eyeing this project to increase their yield. Our wish is to work with the aquaponics in the university to try this new project, to plant other plants here in the soil and then the other ones in the aquaponics. But our dream is to have our little one in the year at school. The aquaponics project serves as a research platform for agricultural NNMU students. It is expected to produce two tons of vegetables and fish annually. Jade Lee Paulser, SABC News, Port Elizabeth.